On August 21, the Air Force announced that Secretary of the Air Force Barbara Barrett, Air Force Chief of Staff General Charles Q. Brown, Jr., and Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force Joanne S. Base came together to witness the advances in a fully autonomous people transport developed by the LIP aircraft. According to a recent service news release, top Air Force leaders gathered with their Texas National Guard hosts and AFWorks personnel to watch the first Agility Prime Orb flight demonstration. The demonstration was presented by LIP aircraft, a Texas-based small business innovation research SBIR, contract recipient, as one of the first companies of its size to join the Agility Prime Air Race to certification. The aircraft resembles a large drone with 18 sets of propellers, motors, and batteries. It has one seat for the pilot and weighs only 432 pounds, which qualifies it as a powered ultralight by the FAA so no pilot's license is required to fly. Electric multirotor aircraft fly using something called Distributed Electric Propulsion DEP, which allows an aircraft to be controlled simply by varying the speed of multiple electric motors, a task that is accomplished by flight control computers. The pilot is not flying the aircraft in the sense of traditional helicopters and fixed-wing airplanes says Colin Ginn, a drone industry pioneer who has held leadership roles at DJI, 3D Robotics, and Hangar Technologies. With DEP aircraft, like with drones, the flight computer is keeping the aircraft stabilized and the pilot merely provides control inputs using a joystick. Agility Prime is a program with a vision of world impact, Barrett said during the program's launch in April 2020. The thought of an electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicle a flying car might seem straight out of a Hollywood movie, but by partnering today with stakeholders across industries and agencies, we can set up the United States for this aerospace phenomenon. In the heat of the afternoon, Matthew Chasen, LIP Chief Executive Officer, piloted the HEXA over the Camp Mabry Parade Ground, just a few miles from downtown Austin. We now have over 15 of the leading aircraft manufacturers in the world applying to partner with Agility Prime, with many of them already on contract, said Colonel Nathan Diller, AFWorks Director and Agility Prime Lead. This flight today marks the first of many demonstrations and near-term flight tests designed to reduce the technical risk and prepare for Agility Prime fielding in 2023.